Well, last night, the Memphis Tigers basketball team arrived back in the Bluff City after a conference championship, a historic win for the program, and an automatic bid to the NCAA tournament. They look pretty happy, don't they? It's also the first ever AAC championship for the Tigers since they joined that league 10 years ago, and they did it beating the number one team in the country, Houston, 75 to 65. The Tigers go on now in the tournament to play Florida Atlantic. That's on Friday. Now the Tigers gear up for a run in that NCAA tournament, which is this weekend, and Penny Hardaway isn't the only former Tiger coaching up this year's team. He's getting some help from one of Memphis's most decorated alums. Avery, any longtime fan remembers this guy. Yeah, Joey Dorsey knows a little something about the NCAA tournament. After all, he played on the 0708 team that went to the national championship game. After a great college and pro career, he's come back to Memphis to teach the latest generation of Tigers what it takes to be great. If you're around town or in FedEx Forum and see a hulking figure with a familiar face, your eyes aren't deceiving you. It's likely Tigers great Joey Dorsey. When I go to uh, Esporta, you know, people see me in there and be like, Man, you look like this guy named Joey Dorsey used to play. I'm like, that is me. <laughs> Joey Dorsey was a Memphis Tiger from 2004 to 2008. Dorsey was a CUSA Conference Defensive Player of the Year, an All-Conference USA First Teamer, and is a top five Tiger in field goal percentage, rebounds, and block shots, among other things. He played under coach John Calipari. Dorsey was the defensive anchor, a role he had to grow into. I was fighting Cal on this when I was here. I want you to be Ben Wallace. I say, Cal, I'm not Ben Wallace, man. I, I played 3-4 when I was in high school. Now you want to change me into this guy, got me all strong, now I can't shoot. It took another Tigers legend to convince him. It took Coach Penny. Penny came in at nighttime working out on the treadmill. We talked. He said, man, listen to me. You got it. Like, you're guarding your man and another man on the court. You say, God's not doing that in college. You got a chance to make it. As a senior in 2008, he found his groove when it mattered most. Against Kevin Love, I had 15 rebounds against UCLA. And going back to the room, I'm like, damn, I had a bad game. I didn't even get to score. But we won the game. First thing pop up on ESPN is Joey Dorsey was the key of the game. He had zero points with 15 rebounds. That's why Memphis won. Memphis went all the way to the natty that year, falling to Kansas in one of the most exciting title games ever. Dorsey went on to a pro career, both in the NBA and in Europe. He crossed the pond a few times, each side helping his game. Having accomplished his pro goals, Dorsey decided it was time to come back stateside. He had an itch to coach, and who better to call than an old friend? And I was like, you know what? Call P up, let him know, like, man, I would love to come down to Memphis and help you out with the big guys. Come on down, we need you. Like, what's, what's, what's holding you up? Penny asked Dorsey to handle his bigs, most notably Kale Derichi Akabundu Ikiogu, the transfer. Go quick, go back, go back, go back. So I'm just thinking, like, okay, I'm just hands on with KO right now. So then it was like, all right, work out all the bigs. And now it's like, I can see all of them getting better. And he has a unique coaching approach. Uh -huh. oh. The move. Hell no. Oh. Uh -huh. The move. Joey speaks the language. You know, he's closer to their age. He was a big here when he went to the, you know, the final, uh, the NCAA final game. Uh, he he understands how those guys feel because he was in their shoes. Hey. Since he ain't been out here. Uh huh. Oh. Hey, come on, we playing. You you got scoring me because I feel like. If you can go against me and score on me, then who in the league right now is going to check you in college? You know, it's been really good having him around. You know, it's, it's different when you're being taught something from somebody who's been where you're literally trying to go. A great as a player, he's teaching the next generation now, putting a different type of stamp on the legacy of Joey Dorsey. How the fans embrace me as I'm from Memphis, that, that, that's enough. That's enough for me. The, the love that I have here is unreal. I wouldn't, I wouldn't want to be anywhere else but Memphis, to tell you the truth. Dorsey's on the Tigers staff as a volunteer assistant. He'll help them try to match his championship run starting Friday against Florida Atlantic. I'm Avery Braxton.